This is a video of the Dynamax ISADA 4 series. It is the 25FW model and as you can see this is in the Cabernet color scheme. We actually have it parked in our front yard right here hooked up to a 30 amp and we like it because it's small enough. You could take it to any one of the parks with only being 25 feet long. As you can see, we have an outdoor TV here. There's ample storage here. Um, each one of the cargo, in addition to be easy, clean, and drain, they do have a light. Um, there you'll see that's the crank because it has a spare tire. That is the on-demand water heater with an exterior plug-in receptacle and a lighted grab bar for the front door. It has the tinted frameless windows. There's exterior speakers along with the TV. It has a 16-foot awning there. Um, here's another of even larger bay here. And there's a little bit of a pass-through there. On this one, there's a full pass-through all the way to the other side. We also have a 7,500-pound um, hitch. It has both a 4-pin and a 7-pin connector. The roof ladder, there's LED lights for brakes, turns, and signals. Uh, you're going to see there's the uh, rear camera. We do have a full wall slide here. This is the other side of the pass-through. And we have the 30 amp plugged in here at the house. There's the cable satellite connection. There's an outdoor service bay with a black tank flush. It has an outdoor shower. It also has a digital tank monitoring kit for gray, uh, fresh, and black, and then also a water pump switch. There you can see we have the, the sewer and it has the hole in the middle so you can keep that closed. There is the propane. There's a quick connect propane here. It is a gas engine. There's also for winterizing, we have the fresh water. We have the Alcoa aluminum wheels. Here's another big tank uh, cargo. And all of these have the um, lights, the cargo lights in them. Now I'm going to get by here. You're going to see on this side, we have an Onan 4K generator. I think it only has about 40 hours on it. Here's the other camera, the side view camera. It automatically turns on when you put on your blinkers. We have the aluminum step. The mirrors on this side, nice big mirrors. They're both power and heated. And then you also have here is a booster switch. If for any reason your chassis battery was to go dead, you can start the engine off of the coach batteries. Now, we do have power windows. There's a lot of storage right here. You have the power driver's seat. The passenger is a swivel seat with a booster. They're a nice uh, leather there. As you can see, it's a nice big cab. The seats are very comfortable. There's the other Alcoa aluminum wheels. You'll see it has the diamond paint protection. So that comes in really handy for cleaning off bugs and things of that nature. So now we're going to go inside. As you see, we do have a, um, a light outside, an LED light outside. It is a 16 foot um, auto retractable awning. It's armless and powered. So now we're going to go inside and the dual batteries are under the step. And as we go in, you're going to notice that it has the over cab bed. Now this, I put out the recliner. It is a full recliner. As you notice, it has the theater seats. We absolutely love that. And it has the rotating tables with it. You will notice this is a very nice, big living area. You have a very nice, large kitchen area. 
So it really makes it nice when you're staying. You've got plenty of room here. That's the over the cab. You'll notice there's the ladder there, but there's also a rod with cameras. If you wanted to um, curtain off that bunk area, you can curtain off the bunk area. There is a TV, a second TV. So you have the outside TV and this TV, and there's storage all underneath that TV. Up above, we not only have the dual 100 watt solar panel charger controller, there's a Jensen stereo, there's the satellite because we have in motion satellite. So that's the in motion satellite, and right beside it is for the over the air antenna. This is the command center. It's a touch screen. It does all of the lights, the shows you what the generator is. Let me see, can we see what power, how many hours we have on it? Oh, okay. Um, I'll have to look that one up for you. There's all of your fuses and everything. When you come in the door, you also have a complete set of switches here. These are for all of your lights, for your awning lights, your exterior lights, cargo lights, your entry step has a light. Um, there's also a USB. There's a remote switch for your inverter, which is in that first outside cabin. It's a 1,000 watt pure sine wave inverter. This is the control for your on-demand hot water heater. It has a recirculating. You can turn on and off for instant hot water or for you waiting eight seconds for your hot water. Either way, one way you can save more propane. There's automatic leveling. We also have the trash. So that's a really nice option that you can have a little place to put your trash can in the kitchen. There's another GFI. We have the extension that comes up in the kitchen. These are solid surface. Um, this is a full stainless sink. Has a high arc faucet, but you can put the pieces back in so that way you have extra prep area. In the kitchen you have a three burner gas stove along with a gas oven and also a convection microwave. So you do have the convection microwave, the three burner stove with the glass top, and the full gas oven. But there's plenty of storage underneath and plenty of storage up above. There's also, we have the dish receiver up above with more storage up here. You can see that's really deep storage. It goes the full length of the refrigerator. This is a 12 cubic foot refrigerator, freezer. Very nice with bins and it's got the little holders which keeps the... Uh... Okay, we also have a pantry here. And it's a very nice deep five shelf pantry. These are fully extendable bins that come out and see how deep those are. Then we go into a huge bathroom. You can see the stainless sink with storage below and also a medicine cabinet above. It has more storage along the side here. We have the max air vent with the remote. There's a area for storing your linens. It has the soft close shower door with the spa rain head, a porcelain toilet with the foot flush, and there is the water pump. So when you're not on city water and you want to use it, work off the tank, it's right there accessible for you in the bathroom. In the bedroom, we have a full walk around queen bed. As you can notice, it has the um, TV. In addition to a TV, you have your furnace and AC thermostat, blackout shades, LED overhead lighting, custom bed package. So that bedding and everything comes with it. Underneath, you're going to see that it also has a plug-in for your chargers and things of that nature along with your converter. 
You will notice that the closet is the full depth of the recliner. And so this is really a huge, let me move this little table, I'll take that table out of the way. It is a huge closet, cedar lined. It has dual hanging rods. So that way, oh, and it's got the auto motion light that turns on when you come in. Cedar lined in the back. The drawers are fully cedar lined. And you can see how deep those come out. Then those are soft closed drawers. Um, so it's got a really huge closet. But this has an ample amount of living space here. You can see we have the power recliner already fully reclined. It comes out almost all of the way. And um, it's very, very quiet. Give me a second and I will start retracting it. You barely even hear it as it comes in. You do have lighted cup holders. These are power with the USB. It has remotes for each one of the TVs. There's another Max Air Vent here in the main room. It has the rain cover and the remote. Overhead LED lighting. You've got the cab over bunk. As you'll notice, all of the AC, this is all uh, ducted. It's a ducted AC and furnace. The furnace is a, I believe, a 35,000 BTU. The air conditioner is a 15,000 BTU. The on-demand water heater is a 60,000 BTU. Um, we got some nice coordinating rugs here. It has the custom Isada 4 rug in the front. Oh, and in the cab, so in the cab, we have a lot of storage also in the cab in regards to the, the cups and things of that nature. But one of my favorites is the tire pressure monitoring system. That's a TST 507. It shows both tire pressure and temperature. We have the camera. We have a Sirius radio, Bluetooth, um... What else is in here? The tow haul mode is right there. That is an adjustable steering wheel. It'll go up or down to fit for you. Um, there is our over-the-air antenna. It's got LED lighting if somebody's up there and wants to read or anything. That's our third TV. So we had a TV in the bedroom, a TV outside, and a TV here in the front. has a fire extinguisher. Uh, it has carbon monoxide, um, you know, all of those, those, those warning, those signal sensors. And then we have the dual batteries with a cutoff switch here by the front door. You'll notice there's the cutoff switch. And it's got the dual batteries. And that is the 25FW. Welcome to our home. We thank you for taking time to spend with us. And if you would like to see our RV, well, please give us a call. Thank you.